very simple, listen to my instructions and obey my instructions at all times. If I say break or stop, you will stop punching, you will take a step backwards. Do you understand me? Touch them up, boys, let's get into it. So two young undefeated fighters meet the winner to win through to some big opportunities and some level of stardom in Australian boxing. A big crowd here to see it as well. And plenty of the Western Sydney Wanderers fans, the RBB, are here to see Darren Garra Truella, who is one of their own. It's them you'll hear singing throughout this contest as long as it goes their way. And Truella wears largely orange. Jensen, he is the southpaw in the white trunks with all the ink. And Truella has a touch of quality about him. Jensen, we know there's something there. He was a very good amateur. Let's see what he does in this, his fourth fight as a professional. A little shot there, Truella, as he came towards. And you can see the concentration on the face of Truella and Sean Porter. It's been mentioned he's done a lot of sparring in the US in preparation for this fight, so you'd expect to see some improvement from where he's been. Awesome, yeah, I, 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 he, he's, he's not afraid to punch at this point. I knew that about him. I knew he was pretty explosive, but I got to say, Jensen really playing this southpaw stance to the best that it could be done. Circling to his right, and waiting on the opportunity to counter like that right there. There's a good shot from Truella, and it was Jensen coming back with that counter, but there's good shots from Truella, who goes to work. Jensen, he's stuck in this corner for a moment, and Truella poured it in. I think that right there was all those punches he threw, every, every bit of it was precise, right on the mark. Worrying signs there for Jensen who was flat-footed and stuck in a neutral corner as Truella uncorked a bunch of it. Explosive stuff from Darren Garrett Truella in this, the opening round. And now he's got Jensen moving the way he needs him to move, moving into his power hand. Jensen's now circling in his left, which is not the way he should be circling going against that orthodox fighter. Closes in again, just Truella. And Jensen, and he wears that overhand right, but gee, there's some redness on the neck of Jensen where he's taken a bunch of shots from that right hand. He comes forward himself with a good shot. Jensen with that left hand, and he's going to have to find some power too because at the moment, Truella is coming towards him without a worry in the world. You, you talked about the red markings on the neck. In this corner, whatever punch didn't hit the chin, it hit the neck. That's how precise he was. He is as red as you like right now, Jensen, after taking a lot of leather. Here he is in this corner again, but away to his right goes Jensen, and he gets a moment to attack, but Torella works nicely. Gets himself clear, and he'll be very happy with the opening three minutes of this one. Darren Garrett Truella. This right here, man, this was just, he found a moment, and he wouldn't let it go. Look, chin, 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 chin. I mean, he was precise with all of that. Great moment right there to start this fight for Truella. Look at that, all that, right where it needed to be. And they've got a bit to sing about to the RBB because their man, Darren Garrett Truella, has had a very good start to this one. The ultra impressive young Sydney cider. Look for it. Exit clean now. It's very important. And while they're relaxed, there's some soul searching to go on in the Jensen corner. Listen, Ben, I don't know what his corner told him, but I would tell him, push Truella back. You, he has to take control of this ring. Oh, there's a huge right hand from Truella. Clatters into the jaw. Jensen wore it nicely, but he needs to look right out for that right hand. Truella punching hard and accurate. 
Let's see if Jensen can push forward and push Truella back. As he flies off to the body there, Truella. Well, we know Truella can, he can lead off. And we just saw him counter right there, but he countered off with one punch. When I, when I mean, when I say push forward, I mean Jensen's got to throw combinations. He's got to throw double jab, double jab left hand, and really push um, Truella back and force him to be defensive. Well, he is moving forwards now, Jensen, but he's not taking his punches with him. Let's see if he can up the ante here. As Truella tries to find that right hand over the top. Now he drives to the body with the right hand, Truella. Just measuring at the moment, but he'll explode shortly if given the chance. It's Jensen who comes back with his power shot. And then Truella fires back with the right hand. My dad would give me an adjustment, and then he'd just yell, just try it, just try it. And that's what Jensen's got to do. He's just got to try it. You can see him being effective. He's just got to try it. Well, he's back to moving laterally here as Jensen. The inch is forward, but not much conviction about it. No, not much right there. I mean, do the combination, but didn't throw enough to get the attention of Truella. There we go. Body shots from Jensen. And he looks good when he's doing that. One thing at least, he's slowed down the output from Truella in this second round. And sometimes that's all you need to do. Sometimes the offense isn't always meant to land. Just kind of like tame your opponent. Three-punch combination there, Truella, and he goes again with that straight right hand. He marches forward and looks for a hook off the back. There's a good shot from Jensen. His best punch of the fight, but Truella wore it well. Better stuff there for a moment from Jensen, who goes again with that left hand. Jensen just having some better moments late, but he takes a big right hand again from Truella. He cannot continue to do that. Truella again. And they like that, the RBB. Here is Nico. Rafa, welcome back. A disappointing title fight for you in Las Vegas. Why will tonight be different? Look, you know, I, I took that fight, you know, too easy. I thought, you know, 41 years old. I thought I'd get him out there pretty early, but that's not the case. So I'm taking this very, very seriously. Um, you know, I'm expecting the best Tommy Brown. I want that. It brings the dog out of me. Um, I'm excited. As I said, the bad blood's been said the few days prior. Um, now it's time to get in there and show, showcase my ability. Well, you're right. Speaking of Tommy Brown, it has gotten quite heated between the two of you. What should he expect from you this evening? My best. Oh, like I said, I've trained super half this fight. I haven't taken him lightly. He thinks I've overlooked him. That's definitely not been the case. I'm ready to go out there and make a huge statement and, uh, and hurt him pretty early. Good luck, Michael. Thank you, brother. Michael Zarafa there, and well, this man knows plenty about that matchup. He fought both Anthony, he fought both Michael Zarafa and Tommy Brown at stages in his career, had vastly different results, stopping Tommy Brown in round two and being stopped in the first by Michael Zarafa. Right now, he's watching a relative in Darren Garrett Truella, who is looking very, very good, but Calvin Jensen did have much better moments there in that second round. A bit to work with. It was a very close second round from, from uh, both guys. Uh, Jensen working much more with, with his offense. I want to see him continue to pick that up this round. He'll be much happier with that second round, but he still took too many of those right hands. He counters well with the left hand there, though, does Jensen. He's just gradually finding his way into this fight. Yeah, we've seen a couple of good straight right hands to the body coming from Truella. I'm really wondering if he's trying to set up a straight right to the head. It's like a misdirection a few times is going to the body right there, a jab to the body as well. He doesn't have the same output that he did in the opening round, Truella, when he had all that success. There's a counter right hand, though, and the corner did enjoy that shot from Truella. Well. 
There's his right hand, but Jensen covers up. He wheels around to his left. Because Jensen he comes forward as Truella departs for a moment. You know, Jensen's doing himself a disservice. You got a Truella in front of you that's fast and explosive. He's not using it, you have to take advantage, and Jensen's not doing that. He talks to him now, does Truella. There's a good shot to the uppercut with that left hand. There's a better right hand too. Truella, good moments, and Jensen fires back. Good exchanges right there from these guys. This one's starting to fire up. This is what we expected out of a fight between two undefeated boxers. Both 3-0, stepping it up. And it's a quality contest so far as Jensen counters. Nice counter from Jensen. Starting to find some timing. Yeah, feels that way. He's and, and starting look, to find Frank, his man. He looks more comfortable, too. Frank! Frank! Step back. I always, you know, explain that real quick. When a fighter gets comfortable, he's able to think better. He's able to kind of navigate himself through the fight better. And so it's that's that's what I mean when he's when I'm talking about being comfortable in the ring. You gotta have some comfort. Bit of posturing through the last 10 or 15 seconds of the rounds. Jensen at least worried Truella out of his shots there. They have fun, right? But listen. Right. right in with the 10. Three. No one ten. Pull out one ten. Come in. Stay in there. Smother whatever shot you got there. Stay in there. Come back with that three. Cover up. Rolling in, rolling out. Rolling in, rolling out. Follow your shots if you need to. Yeah. One. One. Up. Three, yeah? On the ropes. Right. Gotta show my stance when I'm following in. You have to. Yeah. You have to bring it close. Yeah. Got up, got up. Don't let him touch you. Don't marks. And it's meditation time for Cohen Mazudia. He will be picturing the events of tonight. He spends a lot of time doing this. I wonder what he's just seen. I thought he was sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I'm sure he... That I used to do that, and I just try to see the fight. See the fight over and over and over. Darren Garrett Truella. Well, he had some pretty direct advice there from trainer Tony Del Vecchio. Let's see if he can put it into action. He wants him going forward and staying in the pocket a bit more. Yeah, all of the shots that Jensen's able to land, it's when Truel is on the outside. There's no, not a lot of work on the inside coming from Jensen, but, you know, at this point we haven't seen Truella get close and stay in there. Like we always say, all the way in or all the way out. Like that right there. Just can't find Truella with those shots, Jensen. It's, it's two shots and reset. Two shots and reset. Jensen's got to do more. Step in, step in. I got left, step in. It's not going to hurt you. And the corner continues to ask Truella to go forward. He just sits down on that right hand. There was an opportunity for it, but he couldn't quite find his target as he goes forward again. And Jensen uses his head nicely. Then they're in tight, and it was Jensen who scored. Good defense, Lee Boy. Better, much better work from Jensen. Just, just his timing is picked up. There's a good shot, and another from Jensen. Nice. Doubling up with the same hand. The left hand getting to work for Calvin Jensen. The Sunshine Coast product having some good moments here in round four. This is a six-rounder. And he needs to continue to step it up. It was a very strong opening round from Darren Garrett Truella. The fight has evened out since. But no doubt, Jensen needs to step things up. Right hand from Truella. He does that a lot, doesn't he? Stamp with that right foot, Darren Garrett Truella. I've noticed that. I'm not sure if that's an intimidation tactic or what. It's not a feint. Usually when you stump, you're stumping with the front foot, not the back foot. Yeah. A little 
Shot on the inside from Truella. And he stops again. Nothing much after it. Good shot there, though, from Calvin Jensen. And he tries to work to the body as Truella covers up. I want to tell you, Ben, the worst thing Truella could have done in this fight was slow down. That pace he came out in the first round where he needs Good that shot one. there from Jensen, too. Nice left hand. And he turns that one around. And no doubt at all that as Truella has slowed down, Jensen has found himself further in this fight. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it in. How's your legs? Good. Run that down. Let's go. We need more of that. He doesn't like it here, okay? Yeah. But you've got to roll. You've got to roll. One. Yeah. More than one, mate. Fin finish on that right hook with him. Yeah. yeah. You're right. How you feeling? Good. Need two big rounds. Yep. How's the motor? Good. Yeah. When he's on the back foot, he, he doesn't like being on the back foot. Yep. Okay. Let's go. Well, there's not much being said, but it's all pretty accurate in the corner. No, no, no. Very accurate in the corner. It was a, a quiet exchange, but yeah. that is exactly right. That is what he's got to do, just continue to push forward and worry Truella out of his shots. And the stats, the punch stats tell us this is very close. Overall, 76 connected punches to Truella. 75 for Calvin Jensen. Of course, that doesn't impact the scoring, but it does tell you this is a close fight overall. I got a tie game here. I think Truella needs to pick up this pace and push Jensen back. And what I said, you know, after that first round is that Jensen needs to do what he's been able to do now the last two rounds, which is control the fight with his jab and, his, and, and push Truella back. There you go. Go in as they fire off big shots, Sean Porter has it two rounds apiece here in round five. Listen, we got 3-0 and against 3-0. and This is how it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be competitive. There's a good shot, Truell. That reaches out with the right hand. He needs more of that. Needs more of that. Why stop? You know, you land that big punch, keep going. Leads with that right hand now, Truell. Jensen backs off for a moment, but probably not for long. Put them together, son. Put them together. Step on him. Step on him. Body shots from Jensen. One thing for sure, Calvin Jensen has quietened down the singing from the Truella fans. They were full of voice early, but they have shut up shop at this point. I should tell you something. Messy stuff, but a couple of shots through from both fighters, and it is Truella who works as they part ways there. Jensen tries to pile forward. Truella gets a right hand away. Don't hold! Don't hold! I gotta tell you, Jensen seems to be boxing like very smartly. Look at that. Straight left, and then he pivoted, he turned, got out of the line of fire. Now using his legs nicely, and there's another good shot, and another with that left hand. Calvin Jensen is scoring more and more with that shot. There's a right hand, though, from Truella. Left hook, too. There were shots on the inside from Jensen. Both of the fighters having good moments. There's a good shot again from Jensen. Much better stuff from Jensen the further we get into this fight. Head slammed together, but no damage done, I don't think. Beautiful shot with that left hand from Jensen. I mean, he's just stepping outside of that, that foot and landing the straight left. That's beautiful work from Jensen this round. Well, there you go. So Calvin Jensen, another strong round. And things did not look good early, but all of a sudden there needs to be some urgency here. Just get that right hand going. Boom, 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 boom,
it's there, but you've got to go and then look the roll under, underneath it, right? Because he's looking to catch you over the top every time. So, ball, ball, bang, bang, roll. Ball, ball, bang, roll. Roll after your shots. One, two, hook, roll. One, two, roll. One, left, right, hook, roll. Look to get your rolls and step on him. Hands up nice and tight. Nice and strong finish now. Balance to get down. Come back hard, yeah? Pretty hard, yeah? Be good. So a big crowd here having a look at a good contest between two undefeated fighters. One round remaining in this six rounder between Darren Garrett Truella and Calvin Jensen. And Sean Porter, how do you have it scored as we enter this final round? I got Jensen up one round. I, I feel like he's really taking control. We saw him just land a straight left right hand right there, or a straight left hand right there, and that's been his punch all night. He has worked his way brilliantly into this fight against the very talented Darren Garrett Truella, who has to find a home for that right hand. That was his punch early on, but he has not. Oh, there it is. There it is. <laughs> you called that one, Ben. There you go. <laughs> he found the shot that he needs more of. Did Darren Garrett Truella. And he tries again. Jensen, though, works well and puts his punches together in combinations as the right hand gets out again from Truella. Oh. And now he's pushing forward, Truella. You got to wonder if he was saving this, if he, you know, was feeling something in an earlier round. A lot of times, early in your career, again, not used to five, six round fights, you don't have, have a true pace. You know, so you get a little worried. We see Truella working now the way he started the fight. That, that lets me know that he saved this. Well, it's time to let it all out for Truella. Body shots there from Jensen. Another shot there from Jensen, but Truella tries to find that big right hand. And he's looking for it still. Good shot with the left hand from Jensen. Right hand again, Truella. Jensen's got to get back to punching and then turning. He's pulling straight back, and that's why he's getting caught. He pushes forward, does Jensen. Right hand from Truella. That's a good shot, too, from Truella. A combination, and he finished with a nice right hand. The uppercut from Jensen, but he's... Under fire here as he comes back with that left hook. Goes to the body too. Does Jensen. Really good stuff in this final round. Both fighters having their moments. 30 seconds remaining in the fight. He just crouches for a moment, Truella. But he needs to push. And he leads with his right hand. And there's an uppercut. As Jensen just stumbled for a moment over the, the foot of Truella. Head free, punch out. And they stand up and they finish this one on their feet. Six rounds down. Darren Garrett Truella and Calvin Jensen. After six rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges scored this competition 58 56 for your winner by unanimous decision. Fighting out of the Bill Corner!